Let's talk about selling. If you have things to sell, you can start a side hustle. Do you have things that you don't use but someone else would? Think about it. How about you jump on eBay, Facebook Marketplace, offer up, or whatever. Get those things out of your house and have them make you some money. Don't forget about flipping or fixing stuff. Find these items for free or even for cheap and resell them for a higher price. Market them. Mark it up. When you get the items for free, you make profit as long as you don't give it away for free. And if you get it for cheap, make sure you resell it for more than what you bought it for. Otherwise, you will need a side hustle for the side hustle. That don't make sense. Huh? Pro tip, if you can't fix it, don't get it. Ooh, you sellers are gonna love this one. We gotta talk about drop shipping. With drop shipping, you can sell a product on your website without keeping it in stock. There are plenty of drop shipping companies to choose from, and you can do this from Etsy, Amazon, and more. Less storage, more money. If you like Amazon, consider becoming an Amazon affiliate. If you have a strong following on social media sites like Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter, Fa you, you know what I'm talking about. Introduce your followers to products on Amazon that might resonate with them and when they purchase those products, you can get paid. That ain't bad. If all you can offer is your time, that's okay. You can sell that too. You can run errands for folks on sites like TaskRabbit. Sell your time there. You might be like, what? There is no way people would pay me to do this. This is a walk in the park. And then you may find that there's somebody who's willing to pay you to walk their dog in the park. Remember, if you have things to sell, you can start a side hustle. If you're looking for other ways to exercise your side hustle muscle, click this video right here.